This is Punta de Mita, has been like that from the 1760s was the name. So more than 300 years old with that name. Before that, it was called Punta Tintoque or Yos Tintoque because the Tintoque tribe that it was living just over there on the Punta de Mita. Then the Spanish people changed the name to Punta de Mita because an exchange they were making with the Indians, they will give them uh, arrows made of steel and the Indian tribes will give them pearls. That's why it's called Punta de Mita. Mita means arrow or Nahuatl. Hmm. Puerto Vallarta is on the middle of the bay. Sayulita hmm. is on the back side of this mountain. Yeah. Over there. Yep. We are in the Mexican jungle, north of Punta Mita. Very cool. We took ATVs here. Jesse did. Oh. The other ones were good. Thank you. We are here in Mexico and we just met Donald Trump the donkey. This is what they named him here at the ranch. His hair resembles Donald Trump. This is pretty cool. Yeah. This is Flag Street of Sam Poncho. Here we've got gold flags. Moana. It is Moana. It's Moana. Yeah. Moana. Yeah. This is neat, huh? It's got cool. restaurants and shops. Seems like much smaller than Sayurita. We are checking out San Poncho Beach. Nice day. Mm. Hello, welcome. Hola. How are you, lady? Good, how are you? I'm really nice. Good. Beautiful. Oh. Nice, no? Yes, very nice. Good. We're from Maine. Maine? Yep. Do you know yeah, where that is? No. It's where in is it? uh, United States in the Northeast near Boston. Oh, wow. Near Boston, Massachusetts. Okay, Massachusetts. So let's put that <laughs> when I launch it. We're surfing over there. studio in Sayulita. So beautiful. It's early, it's 8 a.m. It gets really busy, so I got here early to 
maybe sure maybe this spot. But the ocean is right over there. Can, this is a hotel too. I would love to stay at. There's a really yummy cafe downstairs. big today. Jesse went surfing. Caught a bunch of waves this morning. Big waves. We will see what's around this corner. Nice hotels over here. Shade. I'm definitely gonna have to go in the ocean when I get to this beach. Hopefully we can swim. There's a catamaran out there. A fishing boat. Whoa! You see a million dollar view. Wow. Now that is worth the walk. Beautiful beach in the north end of Sayuli Beach. Amazing views. Oh yeah, those caves. That's where we have to go. Or we could walk around, up and around. We can watch and see what the waves do for a minute. Welcome to the Mexican jungle. Looks like we have to go through this to get to the beach. But that's okay, this looks pretty cool. Just watch, watch my step. This is amazing. I'm in the jungle of Mexico, taking a walk. The ocean's right by us, so you can easily cool off. But, wow, this is amazing. Not feeling so good. I started feeling shitty after breakfast this morning. This was kind of a stinker about Mexico. The food is delicious and there's lots of amazing options. But you just have to be careful of what you eat. I just got over the norovirus. Hope I didn't get it again. I'm struggling here with my walk. Probably dehydrated. And hot. Ah, made it to the beach. All right, you guys go. Quick. Oh boy. You gotta crawl. Hurry. Crawl. Oh, it's wet. Oh my god, dude, hurry up. Why are you going so slow? I'm stressed, my dad. Oh, and we made it to the other side. Wow. It's so quiet here. Beautiful. We just crawled through that cave. Wow, this is really nice. So the surf is up today. days were kind of messy. But look at that long one. So the surf looks really good today. Kind of glad we saw it because the past week has not been that great. So we see, we see that there is good surf here. I didn't 
didn't even it doesn't start. always do that. No, it doesn't always do it. It's a little bit smaller today. The tide is high. Yeah, it's, it's a pretty good break for smaller waves, but when it gets big, it only holds till about head high, and then after that, it just all closes out. Yeah. So these guys this morning are getting some really nice things. That was but, the best one we've seen. Since that was. That was like the longest one. But we're leaving today. I'm excited to go home. Cellulita was cool. I think if I came back, I would probably stay in San Pancho or go back down to the Oaxaca area. I like Sayulita, but it just was a little dirty. And I got sick twice. So that was a drag. And everybody got sick. So this guy got another nice baby. But yeah, overall it was pretty fun. Yeah, it's good. It's a pretty area. Yeah, it's very it's pretty. beautiful here. The people are beautiful. People are really kind. The food is fantastic. Yeah, the food was good. But they just don't have the infrastructure in the town. And the result is that the towns are dirty. And there was and a sewer, sick. like there was a sewer break too, which was bad. So like if we ever come back, we're going to somewhere, there's not a, a large town. The farther away you can get from the city center, I think the better off you can. Yeah. But, but I mean, look around, it's gorgeous. But we went yesterday afternoon up the coast, just north, and it was beautiful. There's a beautiful beach up there. And that was awesome. And then just south is Punta Mita. And then... Which was really nice also. Yeah. But you know, Mexico is supposed to be inexpensive. It it's was, not inexpensive. It was I mean, not. We paid as much for this place as we would a condo in Princeville, Ooh, Hawaii. Look at this one. I mean, the street taco was cheap, yes. But going out to dinner... It's cheaper, a little bit it's cheaper. It's cheaper, but, but... It's not cheap. It's no cheaper than... Like our hand rolled ice cream yesterday was eight dollars. Right. I which paid thirteen dollars for a taco. Yeah, so I mean, that's not cheap. If you find the hole in the wall spots, you know, I think if we spent a little more time here, we'd figure out where to go. We My to, yoga was cheap. When we went to Puerto Escondido, it was cheap. It was like a dollar for a Corona. Yeah. You know, you could have a big meal for thirty bucks for four people. Well, anyway, we gotta go. We gotta go get our taxi back to Puerto Vallarta, catch our plane. So, how do you say? Adios, friends. Adios. <laughs> Adios, amigos. This here is my drink of Mexico. Forget the tequila. This is, this is where it's at.